the year 2023 was filled with test drives of autonomous and flying cars. And as we step into 2024, these vehicles will take center stage, revolutionizing the automotive industry. Many companies have jumped into the race to develop cutting-edge autonomous and flying vehicles. Let's take a look at some of these. Before we dive in, don't forget to like and subscribe to our channel. Klein Vision's Air Car Klein Vision's Air Car looks like a cross between a futuristic Italian supercar and a military tank. The tail extends and wings unfold from a hidden compartment at the touch of a button, transforming the air car from a sleek roadster to a two-passenger aircraft. The fifth-generation flying car completed two 1500 AGL flights at Pistani Airport in Slovakia. The two-seat model weighs 1,100 kilograms and has a load capacity of 200 kilograms per flight. The car plane has an effective power output of 140 horsepower and is powered by a BMW 1.6-liter engine. Aircar's estimated range is 1,000 kilometers, with a flight consumption of 18 liters per hour. Aircar takes you from ground to sky in 300 meters, reaching speeds of up to 200 kilometers per hour. Most importantly, the aircar's stability and controllability are accessible to any pilot. Retractable wings, folding tail surfaces, parachute deployment systems, and other advanced technologies are examples of what this vehicle employs. Since October 2019, the Aircar prototype has been subjected to rigorous ground and flight tests in the experimental category, and after 70 hours, the Aircar was awarded an official certificate of airworthiness by the Slovak Transport Authority. When it hits the market, the Aircar is expected to cost between 500,000 and 1 million US dollars. Xpeng X2 Aero HT's latest flying car concept, the Xpeng X2, completed a successful demonstration flight over the Jiang River in Hunan province. The X2 weighs less than 1,500 pounds and is mostly made of carbon fiber. It has eight propellers powered by electric motors and can fly for nearly a mile in four minutes. It can stay airborne for 25 minutes with a maximum payload of 352 pounds, reaching altitudes of 3,280 feet at a speed of 80 miles per hour. Among its many features are fixed skid landing gear, an integrated parachute, an autopilot, a two-way 4G, 5G communication system, radar ranging, and obstacle sensing. According to the company's founder and president, the aircraft has flown nearly 4,000 test flights in various environments. Boasting multiple advanced features, the X2 aims for mass production in the next two to three years, offering both land and amphibious models with dual driving modes. Waymo Futuristic Driverless Taxi After months of testing, the Silicon Valley-based driverless car company launched Waymo One, a 24-7 robo-taxi service. The Waymo driver is our unmatched experience in autonomous driving technology, and it has accumulated over 20 million miles of real-world driving experience in a variety of situations. The Waymo driver's sensors are extremely powerful, utilizing a combination of LiDAR, cameras, and radar. It has the ability to see up to three football fields in any direction and detect sirens from emergency vehicles, allowing the Waymo driver to visualize the world around it in milliseconds with high accuracy. With its real-time sensors, it is continuously trained on scenarios it's never seen before, and it can tell the difference between safe and uncomfortable driving behaviors. The car's advanced motion control system enables smooth acceleration and braking on congested roads, all while managing bumper-to-bumper -bumper traffic with safe and natural driving movements. You can use the Waymo official app to get on the waitlist to experience this futuristic taxi. Lilium Lilium is a five-seater all-electric vertical takeoff and landing tilt jet. The Lilium jet features two fixed wings, one main wing at the rear of the aircraft, which measures about 11 meters across, and a canard wing at the front of the aircraft, so-called because of its resemblance to a duck. The canard wings each have two flaps, and the main wings have four. Lilium mounts three pioneering all-electric jet engines on each flap, allowing them to pivot and change the direction of the thrust they create. The flaps can each move independently. The Lilium jet will be able to travel 300 kilometers in an hour after a single charge, achieved through the use of 36 engines. Lilium was awarded design organization approval by the European Union Aviation Safety Agency, which effectively has a license to operate and manufacture. 
The company is planning to introduce its flying car to cities across the world by 2025. Volar EVTOL Plane Bellwether is one of the many companies betting on flying cars for the future. Bellwether calls its flying car the Volar, and it resembles a cross between the Batmobile and a flying saucer. The company released a video of a half-scale prototype flying untethered for the first time. The Antelope remote-controlled prototype has a maximum altitude of 13 feet and a top speed of 25 miles per hour. The full-scale Volar will seat four or five people, have a top altitude of 3,000 feet, and a top speed of 135 miles per hour, and enough battery power for a one-hour flight at maximum payload, according to Bellwether. Bellwether's goal is to have its flying car on the market by 2028, and these untethered test flights of a prototype bring it closer, but the company still has a long way to go. Even if the full-size Volar performs as expected, EVTOLs will be zipping across city skies once regulators figure out how to certify them and manage the airspace that the vehicles intend to traverse. Mercedes-Benz Drive Pilot Drive Pilot is a level 3 autonomous system, which means that under certain conditions, you can take your hands off the wheel and, more importantly, your eyes off the road. Mercedes-Benz Drive Pilot is the first and thus far only SAE Level 3 system for conditionally automated driving to be approved for sale in Europe and the US. Drive Pilot, which will be available on the electric EQS Fastback and gas-powered S-Class sedan, will be available in California and Nevada later this fall. The first two states to approve this system, Drive Pilot provides hands-free eyes off driving at up to 40 miles per hour in traffic jam situations on highways, allowing the driver to look away from the road at something else, such as a game or movie. That's a big leap up from the hands-free level 2 systems. It's also only available on Mercedes mapped freeways, with precise GPS positioning to the centimeter. Airbus Pop-Up Taxi Airbus announced that it will launch the world's first sky taxi service in July with Chinese company Ehang. Pop-Up is the world's first modular electric vehicle that can travel on land and in the air, according to Airbus. It was unveiled in 2023, designed by Ital Design and Airbus, and made its debut at the Geneva International Motor Show. The carbon fiber cabin of the vehicle can be combined with two separate electric propelled motors, allowing it to travel on roads or fly. When attached to the flight propellers, the two-seater vehicle is capable of vertical takeoff and landing VTOL, making it ideal for getting around busy cities when stuck in traffic and travelers can plan their journey and book their trip via an app, which would suggest the best transport solution based on the time of day, cost, traffic congestion, and ride-sharing demands. For journeys through megacities with heavy traffic, the cabin can be disconnected from the car module and whisked away by a 16-foot by 14-foot propeller unit, after which it can autonomously jet around the city. Once the passengers have arrived at their destination, the propeller and car modules can return to their charging stations and wait for the next customer. This means that the passengers can stay in the cabin for the entire journey as it flips between modes. Terra Fugia Transition The Transition is the world's first commercially viable flying car. The Transition is a folding wing, two-seat, rotable aircraft designed to fly like a typical light sport aircraft in the air and drive like a typical car on the ground. It can run on premium, unleaded automotive gasoline, fit in a standard single car garage and switch between flight and drive modes in less than a minute. The Terra Fugia Transition is a road-capable flying car that seats two people, including one crew member. The light sports vehicle is powered by a single Rotax 912 ULS piston engine. The maximum speed of this carbon fiber drivable aircraft is 95 knots. The aircraft is equipped with an avionics panel on the dashboard and can also be flown on autopilot mode. The vehicle comprises folding wings and a twin tail and is designed to fit in a standard size garage. Although it may take time for flying cars to cover the skies, we can say the road ahead for flying cars is long but looks promising. What are your thoughts? Be sure to share them in the comments below. And if you enjoyed the video, give it a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel for more.